Well, hi, yo, dears. Welcome back to the island. I have very bad news. And the bad news is the weather is dreadful. And we need to go out. No. But the good news is I decided that uh, before I do the next cave. Oh, oh, other bad news. It is raining into our house. Whew. So as I was saying, before I go into the next cave, I want to tame another. And uh, I got reasons for that. And I gonna need nails for that. I'll give you that. Yeah, because uh, how you tame another, you give them fish. How you get fish, easiest way is to use nails. So yeah. And that's the um, only easy part, really, because yeah, the hard part about taming an other is finding an other. At least in my opinion, or in my um, experience. So normally, I do not go out and say I want to tame another because you just never find one, and you just bump into them and then you tame them. But not this time. No, this time we do purposeful other taming. And I do hope we're gonna find a decent level one. Because ain't nobody get time for low level others. Even though they are super, super, super cute, no matter what level they are. But yeah, or oh, maybe I should have brought more cryopods in case of multiple other sightings and tamings but yeah i'm not gonna worry too much about it now so anyway oh hello mr piranha i don't think so my first goal uh, is like swimming up or down i have no idea what way that river is actually flowing so up or down this redwood ri river here and see if we can see one and they just spawn randomly at where there's fish. So yeah, I, I'm i gonna be looking around and bring you guys back once I found said furry little not fish fish. See you guys in a bit. Okay, so I am here at this lake inside Redwood. Um, here. And... Uh, I didn't have luck so far. I actually saw another earlier, actually right after I cut the camera, but uh, he accidentally died. Uh, yeah, when I was fighting piranhas that attacked me. So yeah, but I saw one in here earlier before I had to fight off all kinds of bad stuff. I mean, there was a Tylocolio and there was an Alpha Carno and there was, um, there was terror birds, there was a micro raptor, and it was. Yeah, it didn't get boring. Now I'm. But I just. From the corner of my eye, I think I saw a cute little otter face at one point when I was in the water. But yeah, right then I was uh, chasing Tadakolio, so I couldn't really look. But I don't think I killed it. So yeah. But yeah, it's other they are really elusive. And I think it's I wanna kill that Hesperonis real quick because if he is gonna proceed to eat all the fish in here and there won't be any fish left for us to tame the other. Um yeah, provided we find other. So how? Huh? It was over here. I can't see. Oh, there you are. Hey, little other. Hello. Oh, you stuck. Level thirty. Oh. It's not that good, but hey, it's another. What? Let's get 
big fish. Oh, you're not that big, but okay. Are you kidding me? I cleared you guys out. There's more. Oh boy. They ate my swim bottoms. And my, my cool shirt. Sushi, we have a piranha problem over here. Can you please help? Sheesh, I thought you ate all them, those guys. Oh, that's the other. <gasps> oh, I almost ate them. Yeah, now you're not coming, huh? Oh, there you are. And there you are. Thanks, bud. Oh, hold on. I need that. What? Stop that. Oh. So that was not what was supposed to happen. Where did the other go? Are you fish? You're fish. There's the other. Okay, so now. Oh no. Hey, 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 hey. Stand still. Stand still. Oh, 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 there, there was the crown. Nope. Come on. Ah, oh, you're cute, but your bitch is too tame, I swear. Oh no. Stand still. Stand still. There we go. Oh, and when was he now? I don't know what to name you yet, but yeah. We have Oh, oh we are dying! Again! That's lovely. I'm so good at this game. Is he coming? Yeah. Oh man, put you back on neutral and let's see. I, I feel kind of bad for it, Nils, but actually you're the one going to make it hot now. And the other can have that fish. There you go. Oh, aren't you cute? You're a girl. I need to come up with a really cute name for you. Actually, I'm just gonna call you... Where is it? For some reason, I don't know why... I'm gonna call you Hinata. Hinata. Just because. So yeah. I just wanna do one fishy fish with the other now. And other than Niels, the other also works on the water. But other than Neos, he won't bring the fish back, so... It's still not the same mechanic. And you don't do a lot of damage, dude. Girl. But you do that. Oh, Thanks for the pearls, girl. So, yeah. So, yeah, that was, that was it for the other, and... Uh, yeah, for that was it for my clothes, I guess. Stupid piranha. And uh, yeah, gonna see you guys back at base. Okay, so now we are back here. I want to take you guys on a metal run. Oh, gonna put food for that. You're gonna keep chill here for a bit. And um, it's already a bit late, but I hope it won't get too dark. Maybe I bring a torch, just in case. Let's see. Um, oh, this? No, we're not. Uh, I'm confused. I'm sorry. Um, and I have been deciding that I need a weight agent. And I've been looking at. Um, is that an egg? That's just poop. At Tony Kami's little brother, Yuchan. And. Leveled his weight already a bit. He had eight levels from sitting around. 
but we need more weight on him if we want to transport massive amounts of metal. Um, there is Explorer Nodes up at uh, Red Peak where Spankylosaurus is chilling out these days because um, back on that um, like plateau thingy, the metal just didn't respawn anymore. <laughs> so I kind of exploited that. Uh, to the point where it takes a while to respawn and so I moved Spankylosaurus over to here to the Red Peak which is also decently close to the base and it has a lot of metal all around that uh, summit and yeah let's grab the Explorer node first and yeah I was sparing that a bit until I have time to do it. Uh, it was really just uh, luck that I even saw it because it has no ruins and nothing. It's just out here between the stones. And it's... I am... Um, hey, Mr. Tech Raptor. It's a Nerva note. And it should be here somewhere. See, I can't even find it. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. I wanted to eat you anyways because you're a free electronics. Why I wanted to get the explorer note first. So where have you been? Down here? Oh there it is. See? Really hard to spot when you don't know it. And it's nervous note number 27. So really far into the story. Or into his journal. I says, damn these barbarians, they've smelled our weakness. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Oh, sorry. Between our battles with the Beast Queen, Mei Yin, and the dragon, the new legion's main army has been distracted and depleted. Lesser tribes have taken advantage by raiding our camps and seizing territory that we claimed with our blood and sweat. Blood, sweat and tears? Isn't that a BTS song? Way better than Mr. Nero Story! Ha! Boom! No, sorry, sorry, sorry. Just a big fan of that song. Fine. Let them have their temporary victories. Let them imagine that they have inflicted real wounds upon us. When I obtain the power of the obelisks, they will pay for every blade of grass they take from me. With that power, I will make them no true regret. Gaius Marcellus Nerva Victoria per Disciplinum. Oh, and I got dark. <laughs> okay, so, um. He didn't. Three levels. That's okay, that's okay. He didn't really say what exactly they. Yeah. But, ah, uh, good on him. Or, I mean, not good on him, really, but. That still makes me happy that he had some setbacks. And now we can't see shit, but I know that there's an explorer note down here somewhere. I want to grab that, even though we can't see. So it was kind of a big ruin, so I, I thought I might be able to find it in the dark. Hello. Oh, there it is. Yay! Um, Sonera's note number eight. Sonera earlier born and it has a pain. Oh, I heard that. Uh, yeah, as I was saying. A painting of the island, or map of yeah, map of the island. So it says, I have allowed the legion to take a reprieve from war, at least for now. We need time to gather our strength and plan our road to conquest before we march again. Augustus did not unite the empire by rushing into battle after all. Such things take time, and more importantly, information. 
As I ride, my scouts are mapping out the surrounding lands and observing any tribes that may oppose us. I have no doubt they are not all like the black thumbs. One could very well prove to be my Mark Anthony or Marcus Aurelius. Please write, if you write all the names in Latin, write all the names in Latin. Wild card, what you doing? It's Marcus Aurelius, okay? And when I find him, I will be prepared. Uh, Mark, Marcus Antonius, I'm sorry, I failed myself. Marcus Aurelius on my brain. Okay. And I'm here, out here in the dark, in the air, and I don't know where to go. And yeah, see you guys. See you guys in the morning. Okay, and we are back at base. The metal is smelting that I grabbed in the night. And uh, yeah, I recorded some footage and it didn't record. Isn't it great? So, um, yeah, just to. Uh, make up for it. I grabbed an explorer note on the way back from Red Peak. Oh, it was just in the middle of Redwood uh, in the ruins. And yeah, in the middle of Redwood, as in between here and Red Peak. And it was Helena Snow number 10. And this one says The painted sharks have treated me like I'm the bloody queen since I showed them the Rockwell's letter of recommendation. I don't think I've eaten better in my entire time on the island. Not that it's a high bar. I'm a horrible cook. Oh, and they've been of tremendous help with my research, of course. So far, my estimates of the predator-prey balance are consistent with the ecosystems on the mainland. The water is simply teeming with shoals of megalodons, and they are extremely aggressive. Perhaps that's a side effect of having limited prey. Sharks are known as territorial creatures. I have to study them further. So yeah, apparently Helena was staying with the, this tribe, the sharks, that are living on the ocean. Um, yeah, is now studying sharks. Um, as we already know, we'll eventually find out that the sharks are too smart for being sharks yeah but anyway um yeah with this and also the other we tamed we we are at the end of this episode because now the next thing we're gonna do is go to the third cave uh, of course that has to be its own episode and yeah we're gonna see if we can do it and uh, don't die of course and until then as always stay wild and stay safe and uh, have a nice day everybody